Sure. We have this feature in our brain wiring to detect patterns, even if they aren't there, because that was in the interest of our survival. We're not making those same decisions anymore about whether we might get eaten by a lion, but that still that that brain feature remains within us. And we see patterns in everything. And we think because we see a pattern that the pattern is real. Even we think the absence of patterns is a pattern. You had a roulette table. <laughs> and I said, why do you keep betting on seven? It's due. It's due. <laughs> it's right. And I say, how do you know it's due? Because the roulette table shows you the previous 10 rolls. Okay, spins. Or the previous 20. And you, you don't see a seven there. It's due. No, it's not due. Go take a freaking probability class. Yeah, it's, a, uh, it's not due. The same way the Washington generals are not due to beat the Harlem Globetrotters. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> How about that? They can play the Washington Generals? I don't know what they're called now. I don't know. They did it like 40 years ago. Made up name. So uh, this, this notion that because it hasn't happened recently, it's bound to happen in your next bet is how casinos make money. Casinos exist to exploit these frailties of the human brain wiring. They exist for that purpose. 